It's a common problem when two monitors or a laptop and an external monitor don't flow correctly from left to right or vice versa in a dual monitor setup. It can be really frustrating and the whole setup feels really awkward and it can even impact your productivity. I experienced this a few years ago, but the few changes to your settings, which I'll show you today, it can make a real positive difference to your productivity and your workflow. Plus it won't affect which monitor you have set up as your primary monitor and you can change this at any time, but a bit more about that later. If you're new here today and you want to see similar videos like this, which helps solve your tech related questions, start now by subscribing to our channel. Okay, so let's dive into the detail right now and look at how to adjust your monitors from left to right in Windows 10. One of the biggest issues when you're setting up multi monitors in Windows 10 is where they're physically placed as opposed to how Windows actually lays out the monitors in its system. Now, as you can see here, we've got two monitors, a dual monitor set up. And one of the biggest issues is the flow between the screens from left to right and vice versa. So if you look on the left hand screen, when we try to move across to the right hand screen, we can't do that. So in order to get to the other screen, we have to mouse over to the left hand side of the left screen. And then the mouse icon appears on the right hand screen from the right hand side. And if you're moving apps between screens, that will also apply as well. So from a workflow flow point of view, that's just simply not work, workable and it will also have an impact on your productivity. So there is an option to get this sorted. You can physically move the screens around, but you don't have to do that. It just takes a few simple tweaks to your settings within Windows 10 itself. To get the situation resolved, if you go down to the search bar and type in display, what you need to select is duplicate or extend to a connected display. Bear in mind that we are using an extended setup, so extend these displays, which means in effect we've got two separate desktops. And when this screen opens, if you look at these sort of the display screens layout, at the moment display two is on the left, display one is on the right within Windows, that's how it sets it out. But if you can see the physical layout is opposite, so one is on the left and two is on the right. So in order to rectify the situation, if we left click and hold the mouse button down on display two, drag it across over display one, press apply. You can now mouse, mouse across the screens and you can also move apps freely across the screens. Now, if you want to make the larger display, the primary display in Windows 10, as I do most frequently is it's the largest screen, so I prefer to use that. I have made a video on how to change the primary monitor in Windows 10. The link's appearing on screen now. Be sure to check it out. But many thanks for watching our video today. We'll see you on the next one.